much revenue have you been able to bring in? 3,500 in two weeks. You actually have your first employee. I tried job shipping. Ridiculous. It makes me sick. Boom, you're gone. A completely different person behind the screen. Landon, what's going on, man? I just want to say, first off, I am really impressed with the success and the progress that you've made so far in such a short amount of time. Um, but before we dive into any of that, could you kind of just give us like a little bit of a background on yourself? <laughs> Uh, yeah, of course. Uh, my name's Landon. I'm 24. I'm from Kentucky. Uh, I went and got a bachelor's degree in human services and social work, but it just didn't feel fulfilling. So I didn't want to go back and get my master's. So I was like, I need, I need a, I need a way out. I need a way out of my master's. And I uh, scrolling through TikTok one day and I stumbled upon your TikTok page, man. And I'm very glad I did. <laughs> so you basically, you didn't get your master's yet, but you graduated with your degree and you were, are you still considering getting your master's? Probably not now. I'll probably pursue this full time, honestly. <laughs> I the, And the numbers to me are crazy. Like very, very impressive how much progress you've made. How much revenue have you been able to bring in so far? So far, I've 3,500 in two weeks. Wow. Uh, and that's cash collected, right? That's cash collected straight into my bank account. Wow. And, and in terms, I know you said like total revenue for the year, what were you at? 13 grand. I think you've been in the program for what? It's like less than a month. Less than a month. Yeah. Probably about three, probably about three weeks. Getting close to three weeks. Dude, that's just insane to me. Cause I like, I've had obviously a lot of students see really good success but I think what makes you stand out is just like the, how fast you were able to do it. You, as soon as you joined the program and I remember meeting with you the first time and I like, I could already tell you, you kind of had it. You, you were going to hit the ground running and just absolutely blow some numbers out of the water, which is exactly what you did. What do you think made you have such fast success? Um, so what made, you, what made me SAS is not magic beans, man. You got to go out there and you got to work. Uh, I work an 80, I still work an 80 hour a week job. And I, I always dress like I always dress nice. I always have like a button up shirt or I have some business, like I have some, you know, dress pants. Uh, there's people that walk up to me. They're like, why are you dressed like this for this job? And I just tell them, I, and they're like, you have a card. I know someone that knows a friend that has a business. It's all about word of mouth in the beginning. And then you start building up with your ads slowly, but surely uh, I've had more uh, success out of referrals than I have in anything else. Um, okay. But that's still working. I haven't pursued this full time yet. Uh, this is an 80. I'm still working an 80 hour a week job and I've, I've made three G's in three weeks. I know you mentioned referrals, right? You're big on referrals and I know you're big on in person. Now I usually, I personally, that's my favorite way too. in person, I think is like one of the best ways you can get clients. Second to that, I'd say is cold calling. I guess hmm. do you have any tips for like what you think people should do if they decide to go in person or go with referrals as one of their main methods of client acquisition? Do you have any tips or anything that you feel like has really given you an edge and just helped you become more successful with that method? Yeah. Um, so with that, it just depends. It's for different client, like clientele for like ladies and stuff. Like I'm very, I'm very soft with ladies, like, you know, sensitive. And I try to remote, like revert more to their feelings yeah. because I have a, I have a degree in social work. So women make more decisions emotionally and men make more uh, decisions logically. Right. So with a woman, a business owner, woman standpoint, I'm like, Oh wow. You're the first woman to, I own a local appliance store here in Somerset. How is that for you? You just ask questions over and over and over again until they finally get down into their fields. And I'm like, how much does this business mean to you? And then I, you know, then I pitch my product, um, with men, you got to be more logically like numbers. You're going to be like, so this will boost your numbers. They're, they're, they're in it for the money. <laughs> right. They're usually, men are usually in it for the money. Women are in it because that's their baby. That's their business. They love it. They love being a business owner. Men are in it to from they're, they're in it for cash. 
yeah and provide for their family you know he don't give two flying craps um, about my story because he has a family to feed so with that you've got to be more logically with men and more soft with women okay yeah no that's really that's a those are good tips i kind of see the same thing definitely men are very much so more logical when you present them with like the facts where it's like okay this is our software platform this is exactly how it's going to help you right now. You're not really doing X, Y, and Z and our platform is going to help you solve those issues. Um, so I definitely see that. And obviously, yeah, women, I feel like are way more emotional. So if you play into that a little bit more, you'll definitely have a lot, uh, a yeah. lot of success that way. But also, uh, with cold calling, you're going to get rejected. If you, if you can't get rejected in sales, man, you, you can't be in sales because it's going to be 50 rejections before you get one. Yes. I, I always tell everyone it's like, it's a numbers game. You know, you can sit there, call all day. You're going to get nose all day. You're going to get nose all day. Uh, and it's all about just like finding the handful of people that are going to say yes. And then just continuing to power through rinse and repeat. And then you're going to get better at it over time. And your percentage of yeses are going to go up slowly, go up, up, up as you do it. Uh, And then that's when the referrals come into play. Once you get a lot of people in that, that are working with you now you're working with them, you're providing them with good results. And then boom, they can start handing out referrals to other. I have, I have one lady that's, that's given me three referrals. So I've given her $300 cash, but you know, in the long run, I'm making more money. Right. Yeah. Yeah, no, that's good too. That I always tell people to do that for the referrals. Incentivize them. Pay, pay them a chunk of money in, up front in the beginning or pay them maybe even a percentage of the monthly recurring. That is one of the best ways to incentivize someone to to refer you. Because now it's like, oh, I can get a little bit of extra money if I like help you get this person signed up. Say less. Sign me up. So, you know, I think those are really, really good strategies. Um, and And... With that being said, like, I know you only joined the program like three weeks ago ish. Um, how would you say that played a role in your success so far with SAS? I am completely computer illiterate, so I have no idea what I'm doing. If if you have a computer and internet, and you're with this SAS, you're, you're with Connor's mentorship program. I mean, he's setting you up to succeed. It's it, he's held my hand through the whole process. Like, I have no idea what I'm doing on this computer at all. <laughs> like, I used to, I used to be able to th- throw a HDMI cord in the back of a TV, and Grandpa would be like, "Wow, he's a genius!" But no, man, I have no idea what I'm doing. Have no idea what I'm doing on this computer. Uh, so he's giving me tips and tricks. I hired my first employee. Uh, he showed me how to do that, and I had an employee within the next two days. And he does all he does all my websites now, man. I just sell it. I can just focus on selling, and I'm also I'm working that much. I mean, it's it's become it's it's big. Like I would have had no idea where even to start. Like he helps you prospect everything. It's yeah, definitely I, I would have never went through SAS without this program at all. I wouldn't know the first thing. I don't care if I how many videos I've watched. Just the one-on-one calls, man. Just saved my butt so many times. Thank you, bro. I appreciate that. And yeah, I completely forgot you actually have your first employee, which <laughs> is just crazy to me that it happened that fast. Um, and you were able to, you were able to hire them like literally. Boom! I jumped on a call with you. I was walking you through the process, and you <laughs> yeah. got them hired legit. Like almost the same night. I think you were like in contact with them the same night or like the next day. Yeah, we, we had a Zoom at like three in the morning. And I was like, I was like, <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm, I'm glad I did, man. He's doing great work. He's, he's awesome. Uh, absolutely changed the game. Like I, I did my first website by myself, looked absolutely crud. And I'm like, oh man, I can't do this. I'm going to need someone to do this. I could sell it all day, but I can't, I cannot edit websites. Yeah. And then you could just focus on selling it. And yeah, you just kind of rinse and repeat that process. You're going out, finding new referrals, finding new people. And yeah, you can let your virtual assistant kind of take care of all the software setup process and anything like that, that you don't really want to take care of. Um, But did you have any hesitations when you were considering joining the inner circle? And like, if so, what were they? Um, I thought you were going to be 
a completely different person behind the screen. I didn't think it, it was you. I thought you were just trying to scam me for my money. Um, <laughs> as soon as I hit, as soon as I hit that interview, man, uh, you know, right before a big purchase, you're going to have a gut feeling sink to your heart, sink to your stomach, but it's an investment on yourself. You got, you got to invest money to make money. And I've already, yeah. you know, I've already made my money back. <laughs> uh, but this is, this is a life changing mentorship because it absolutely gives you the tools to succeed and holds your hand through the whole process. Uh, it, I, I, the gut feel, I thought you were just going to be some fake guru that, you know, I see all over TikTok. They're like magic beans, magic beans, sell this. You're going to sell this and you're going to make millions off this one sale. Drop shipping. I tried drop shipping. The market's too saturated. There's 60,000 yeah. people doing SaaS. So I was like, maybe I can look into it. I did my own research before I saw, you know, I signed up with a mentorship because I was like, I don't even know if SaaS is a real thing. Yeah. Um, drop shipping, definitely, definitely super saturated. Um, and yeah, I think a lot of people are in the same position, like when, when they're thinking about joining a program like this, like, cause there's, and it sucks. There's so many like gurus out there. I put that in quotes because it's, they're not, you can't even, you can't even You're be a called teacher. That. You're a teacher, not a guru, man. For real. For real. <laughs> Thank you. Um, cause like the gurus out there, they will literally take your money and Boom, you're gone. They never, you never get to contact with them. You never get to talk to them. You yep. never get to jump on a call with them. And I think it's just ridiculous. It makes me sick that people are actually okay and can sleep at night doing that. Uh, so I really like to, you know, get out there, meet with you guys one on one, and make sure that you guys are actually moving forward, making progress every single week. Yeah, I have um, no idea how you do that, man. I have no idea. <laughs> you are a busy man. I don't know how you yeah. do that, but you do it. So yeah, dude. Obviously, you've had like really good success so far and it's been such a short amount of time what would you say your plans are and your goals with your SaaS business for like the next six to 12 months well my goals is i want to at least get up to 6k in monthly revenue and then after that man i'm i'm quitting both of my jobs and i'm hitting the road i i just bought a motorcycle i'm i'm packing up all my stuff and i'm gonna run i'm gonna run my business from the beach uh so far, I, I am generated to make to make that in sales. So I'm I'm very excited to see what the past the next few months. I have some you know leads already wanting to sign after school in August. So I'm I'm waiting for I'm just waiting for after school where they can drop their kids off and yeah yeah. Uh, but yeah, my plans are man. I want to be completely online, virtual. I want to go live a life on the road and work from my computer make money while I'm sitting there on the beach. I'm single, have no kids. So yeah. Dude, that's awesome. And that's the way, dude. And you can do it with SaaS because all you really need is your laptop. You need some internet connection and that's really all you need. Uh, you can kind of work from wherever you want. Um, but that's sick. They are already able to get the bike. You know, you're prepping, you're ready. You're close, dude. You're close. And it's only, it's been such a short amount of time. Like I keep saying, um, you are, very, very close to really making it your full-time thing. I think, you know, within the next two to three months, you could probably be out of that nine to five. Um, yeah. I'm, I'm also going to, I'm probably going to get a, like a remote job just on the computer because like, I don't want to do nothing, you know, <laughs> yeah. Sash, I, I want to do nothing. I just sit there and money's <laughs> just drifting in my bank account. Tell my employee, Hey, the client wants this, this, and this, and then I'm done for the day. Like yeah. that's, that's not it. I have to do something. So I'm probably going to get like a remote job or something like a nine to five, like in the evenings or something on my laptop, but it's too, you know, it's, it's more money. You know, you can never have too much money. Yeah, no, exactly. Keep yourself busy. A hundred percent. Um, but yeah, dude, I think your story so far has been just really, really cool. And like, I've had some of my students see really good success, but I think you stand out. Like I said, with just the speed at which you were able to do it. I think it's just really, really awesome. Um, so props to you for that. Extremely impressive Appreciate. what you were able to do. I guess to close it out, one tip or one piece of advice to someone that's on the fence right now. They, they're they looking to maybe get into SaaS. They're looking to maybe join the inner circle and they're kind of just on the fence and they're hesitant about it. What would you say to them? Make the jump. It's it's 100% worth it. I've, I've made my money back in three weeks. Uh, 
and they then they're right there. They're they're true to their word. They're right there holding your hand the whole time. Connor and his whole team, man, is anything. I text him, they'll text me back within twenty to thirty minutes. And it's it's nuts because I know how busy. So I feel like you know, I feel like an ant in an ant hill, but they're taking like they're taking great care of me personally. Uh holding my hand and teaching me how to do all this computer stuff. I have no idea what I'm doing on here. So without Connor's guidance, I wouldn't, I wouldn't have made as much money as I did as I, I, as I have. Thank you, bro. I appreciate that. And yeah, dude, I, I think you're going to keep crushing it. I look forward to continue working with you and see you still absolutely crush. Um, but yeah, I think we can close it out here for today. It was really great speaking with you. Um, you have a great story and yeah, dude. Have a great rest of your day. Let's uh, let's chat soon. Appreciate you, man. We'll stay in contact. Text me.